What's good, YouTube? I'm back with another video. More energetic, more hyper because today is a good day. And this morning, I was telling you guys that, um, you know, today's gonna be a good day. But I just wanted to like talk more and so you guys can get to know me more as a person, who I am, and what I do. And you know, just you know, people don't want to get to know this. But listen, listen. I just want people to know that no matter what you're going through, man, people love you, bro. Like, I don't know how many times I can say this in my videos, but I would say every time if I have to, like, get my point across to anyone and everyone. Like, honestly, oh, y'all come. I did my haircut, you know what I'm saying? But, um, like, today, like, I had, like, I just had an attitude. <laughs> I had an attitude in school, and, you know, my attitude was uncalled for because, you know, a teacher was just basically addressing me how I was continuously late, but she didn't understand that I wasn't late intentionally, like I was actually late to school because I oversleep. And she said, you know, you got to focus on waking up on time, you know, and like, y'all yeah, understand that, you know, but I'm tired, you know, like I stay up, like sometimes I, I have sleepless nights, like sometimes I just stay up late watching videos and like learning more stuff. And there's nothing wrong with that. But, um, she was just telling me, you know, how I should just get to class in time. And I kind of, I took it offensive because she, when people jump straight to conclusion with me, it's a big, 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 huge pet peeve of mine. I hate it so much. Like, ask questions before just assuming anything. And that's just with anyone and everyone. I'm pretty sure you guys wouldn't like that because I wouldn't like that. But it's just like, before you, like, have, like, you know... Have something like to jump and assume right away. Don't assume, you know, ask questions. She basically was like, um, you're skipping class. Three people said they saw you and you are in class. And, you know, just because people say something doesn't mean it's true. Ask questions first, especially when it's about me, you know. Don't give me, don't bring up false information. Um, so I basically was like, well, the people that told you they saw me this morning were lying because... I was not at school. I was at home. And I was doing the vlog this morning. So, basically, that was that. And uh, I also told her that skipping class is not coming to school. And I basically, I, I told her skipping class is basically not coming to class. Skipping class is not coming to class, okay? Skipping class is not being late. Because if we are late to class, that's not skipping. Because we're just being late, which is tardy. So, like, I told her that, and, you know, it kind of it kind of got to me because I, I really take my schoolwork very, like, to the heart. And I, I love school so much. I love everything in school, but sometimes I just get overworked up. And, like, people just don't understand. Like, sometimes I feel like no one appreciates my work because I try so hard. And, like, people don't understand that teachers constantly bug me. You know, not they don't really bug. You know, I'm a good kid in school. I love all my teachers. All my teachers love me. I'm in this program. It's called 811. It's a beautiful program. Um, I basically move four classes each transition to different classes, but I have two electives. And, you know, it's like about like like five to ten people in each class. Like not even ten people. It's stronger than that. It's like, it's like for kids that basically needs, you know, extra cur curriculum, excuse me. But that's what it basically is. And, you know, I appreciate everything. But sometimes, you know, people have a, have their ups and downs, you know. And I don't want to come off, you know, in a weird way or nothing like that. Like, oh, you know, you're always mad. And it's not, it's not like that. But it's just like the fact that, you know, people jump into conclusion with me is something that I don't, I don't, I don't enjoy. I really don't. And hold on. And, like, you know, it's, it's aggravating. I'm a, I'm a good kid. I love to go to school. I go to school every day, even though I might be late. But at least I show up, right? At least, you know, I'd rather be late than not show up at all. You know what I mean? But, you know, I understand teachers are trying to teach me, you know, like, in the real world, when you have a job, you know, you can't be late. You have to actually be uh, 15 minutes beforehand and stuff like that. But we, we are also talking about the present right now. You know what I'm saying? Because cause I'm not trying to, like, sound too crazy, but... I, I'm really not planning on working at a fast food restaurant for half of my high school year or half of my life because, honestly, I want to have a career, you know. I want to act. I want to be a comedian, you know. I could cut hair real good. 
Um, I'm, I'm goofy, I'm funny, I got a good personality, I'm beautiful, and you know, I want to travel the world. I love recording myself just to watch myself. It don't even have to go on any type of social media. But people brought the thought to my head, you know, you should do a YouTube account because, a YouTube channel because, you know, you have that, you have that skill, you know? And it's no type of skill you need to have your own YouTube account. There's no type of skill. It's, it's for anyone and everyone. You know, follow your dreams. People just brought it to my attention that, you know, I should share my videos out instead of just keeping them in my gallery and laughing at myself when other people could be laughing at me too and finding me amazing. So, like, you know, I just try my best. You know, I'm not perfect or anything like that. But, like I said, if, if people actually try to help me, you know, promote me and get to know me, I swear, like, one, one day, everybody will see what I'm talking about. You know, it don't happen overnight. But it does happen. You can't expect it to happen overnight. Some things do happen overnight, you know? But, you know, like I said, I don't I don't think about negativity all the time. I always think about positive things, and that's what's good about me. Because when negative things do happen, I still think about the positive within it, okay? And, like, when I get a felon grade in school, that, that really hurts me because, like, like, what are you doing to yourself? And I don't have any felon grades at all. I pass, I pass, I'm passing all my classes by 80s. But I want to, I, I want to pass by 90s and higher. Now, people like, sometimes, I'm not going to lie, I do get the thought of dropping out of school because I, I get really highly frustrated. And sometimes I will like, you know, my career doesn't revolve around math class or science class or, you know, English, you know, anything like that. Because I want to be an actress, travel the world, make vlogs and make, make videos and stuff like that and like it's just it's just hard sometimes you know but people say you know you don't graduate school you're not gonna be successful it's gonna be hard for you to get a job and stuff like that I do agree you know it might be hard for me to get a job I'm not planning on having a job when I leave school I'm planning on being my own my own person working for my own self I have a logo and I just want to like put it out there you know like have my own merch and, you know, I just, I want to work for myself, be an entrepreneur, basically. You know, that's what it basically is. But, you know, stuff can be hard sometimes. Like, sometimes, you know, I really do think about dropping out of school, but you got to push through stuff to overcome. Like, you have to push through it. And, like, sometimes it can be really rough. Just don't give up. Just don't give up. If you got a dream out there, you follow your dreams, man. I'm not even living my dreams, but I'm shooting for my dreams, and I have a goal, and all I got to do is follow it, okay? And, and, and anybody, everybody, or whoever that hates on me, underestimate me, don't care, talk bad upon me, so, so what? I'm my own person. Like, I mean, like, honestly, everyone has their do's and their don'ts. You know, and I don't understand why people judge other people. It's, it's no use of it, you know. I'm, I'm not going to lie, you know. I judge a few people here and there. I'm not perfect. I'm not saying I'm perfect. Everybody makes mistakes. But it's just also good to know that other people has feelings too, you know. Don't hurt. Because, you know, other just other people have, have feelings, you know. And just when you hurt someone, just think about you being hurt. Would you like to be hurt? Do you want to see anyone hurt? Like, my mom told me, you know, today that she was having twins, but she wasn't having them anymore. And that hurt me because when she did tell me she was having, you know, twins, I was really happy because a new life is coming onto this earth. And, and any any time that something good's happening in my life or something bad, it just... It just keep pushing me, pushing me more to just want to do better. I never want to give up. Even though I think about it, I just can't see myself fail. I can, I can honestly see myself famous and, and everyone just like loving me, man. And, and I love myself for that because I, I honestly see, I see that in myself. I honestly do. And people look at me and laugh like I'm crazy when I say I do YouTube videos and you know, I'm a vlogger and stuff like that. They look at me crazy. I don't know why. They look at me crazy and just laugh like, like I'm like I'm crazy or something. I'm, I'm, people have a dream of being a stripper. Go do it, you know. I'm not gonna judge you, Gay Nation. Ooh, I'm not gonna judge you. I'm not. I can't. Who am I to be judging anyone? Okay, I'm not perfect myself. People call me perfect. Some people call me perfect. You know, in their eyes, I'm I'm I probably am perfect. Okay, but to me as a person. 
I'm not perfect, you know? And, uh, like, it's just hard, you know? It's, it's hard nowadays because people say Donald Trump's the president or they got 99% haters or, you know. But I honestly don't think about negative things. I try to think about positive things, you know what I'm saying? Because law of attraction, you, think, you keep thinking consistently, consistently about positive things, you will bring it up to life. And for someone that's always negative, don't have room in my life because I'm all about positivity, baby. Double P's over here. You feel me? P P. P P. But that's that's basically what I wanted to tell you guys, you know. But um, anyways, this evening it is what time is it? It's 4:23. Shout out to Ace Family. That's my, that's I love them niggas, man. Them them my boys. Them my boys and girls. This is my song right here. Cause you're my ace, the only one I need. Cause you're my ace, you're always down for me. Cause you're my ace, the only one I need. Cause you're my ace, cause you're my ace. Cause you promise me you won't run away. Stay with me, ride with me. But uh, today, I'm just waiting on my grandma to come home, honestly, because we're supposed to be going out to eat. She asked me where I want to go. I love chicken wings. That's one thing you should know about me. Oh, if there's anything that makes my day, bro, bring me about like a pack of 10 chicken wings. Some The hottest buffalo sauce you could get. I love hot stuff. Hot stuff is like makes my water mouth. Even though it's like real, real hot, I still eat it because I love hot stuff. So if you give me a ghost pepper, I'll eat it because it's hot and I love hot stuff. Even though it be hot as hell and I'm like, no, don't give me it again. But I know my, you know, where that's, I'll eat it the next day. So like, you know, I'm about to go to Buffalo Wild Wings and eat me some good, some good, good food, okay? But, um, I mean, even if I don't go to Buffalo Wild Wings or things change, you know, it's still good to go out, you know, with people you love because, you know, Cheers to good moments. My hair look crazy for some reason. But, um, I just want you guys to know, like, any questions, comments, or concerns, you can always DM me. Um, I do have Twitter, but I don't really use it, so I really didn't put it in my description below. I usually put Snapchat, Instagram, and Facebook. You can reach, you can reach me on any social media. You can even comment on my videos just to get out to me. I'm not going to put my number because I'm not going to leak myself. So... I just want to say thank you for watching this video, and if you're watching this video, thank you. Make sure you hit the like button and subscribe and share and comment. Spam it up. Like I say every time, spam it up, spam it up. But but honestly, if you're watching this video right now or if you skipped through it and you watched it, skip back. Go back to the beginning because, you know, people, people call me when I talk. They call it ranting, but it's not ranting. It's just, you know, me expressing who I am as a human. But if you watch this video or are watching this video, I just want to say thank you. Shout out to you. Okay. And, um, you know, life, life is good. Cherish the moment you have because you don't know when it's going to be gone. And if you're going through stuff, you got to smile. <laughs> because I'm going through hell a lot right now. And all I can do is smile and think positive and, and only pray. That's all I can do, honestly. So you guys have a good rest of your day. I'm going to go enjoy my day. I'm going to vlog while I'm at um, Buffalo Wild Wings. And um, I just hope you guys, you know, actually take consideration to my channel and, you know, actually share me and promote me. And that would be lovely. So you guys have a good day. I will see you guys later on. It's J Nation, baby.